Welcome to Dynamic Mental Fitness Training's presentation of Neurosculpting Video Training for improved mental concentration, better mental focus, and stronger willpower. In part four of this six-part series, we continue our discussion on the characteristics and processes of the problem that is procrastination, as well as provide you with an effective technique to pull you out of any unproductive mental pattern and put you back on the path to forward progress. The mental dynamics underlying both the problem of procrastination and the solution to procrastination can be illustrated using a fundamental psychology concept known as the pleasure principle. The concept of the pleasure principle was proposed by Dr. Sigmund Freud to explain a human being's natural tendency to move toward pleasure and move away from pain by adjusting personal actions accordingly. For the purpose of defeating procrastination, knowing that the pleasure principle influences the way we make choices helps us by revealing one key to removing any resistance we encounter at the prospect of starting or completing a productive task. The fact that we are attracted to pleasure tells us that when we're not in the mood to do a good thing, then we only need to alter our thinking about the task so that it seems more appealing. This method works because any thoughts we have toward a task that makes it seem appealing inspires interest within us since we generally tend to move toward pleasure, while thoughts toward a task that make it seem more menacing causes resistance within us naturally because we move away from pain. Whenever you feel hesitancy about a productive task, consider carefully as to how you may be thinking towards it, because the way you feel about a task is a great indicator as to how you are thinking about it, because thought always precedes such emotional states, although you may not even be aware that the thoughts have occurred. Once you have carefully analyzed and determined the content of an associated thought, you can then narrow in on the thought and make creative changes to it willfully so that it reflects a more appealing view of the task ahead. With the appealing view established, you can keep referring to that motivating idea in the future if necessary to inspire momentum forward. Clear awareness of the content and the feel of the thoughts that move through your mind all day long in reaction to everything that happens to you is vital so that you can redirect, alter, or dismiss any misassociation that calls a good thing bad or a bad thing good for you. The Neurosculpting Training System is designed to help you train your attention so thoroughly that no mechanically repetitive thought pattern can rise from your subconscious mind without your being keenly aware of its effects within your mind, including any emotional content that might be attached to a thought, no matter how subtle, no matter how fleeting. Under our system, you can literally transform the manner in which thought operates in your life so that it moves you towards your goals rather than limits your potential. Our fourth mental tool for breaking out of a procrastination mindset is thought drill down. This approach is based on a thought control tactic known as signal interrupt. If, while in the middle of any unproductive mental pattern, you consciously interrupt it and willfully transform negative thoughts into productive ones that reflect a desired outcome, and then hold your attention firmly onto the newly transformed ideas, your mental state, your dominating thoughts, emotions, and impulses, will inevitably adjust to match. As an inspiration, remember that even the journey of a thousand miles begins with one small first step forward. For this exercise, 
Consider a task that you have not begun because you are uncomfortable with it, perhaps one that seems too large or difficult, a task that has remained undone due to your sitting around feeling totally overwhelmed because in your mind there seems to be a thousand pressing things to do all at once. Now, take that uncomfortable idea which, as you think of it, is looming, intimidating, and disturbingly large in your mind, and break it down in your imagination to its smallest individual tasks. You don't need a strong visualization ability to do this. For instance, if you're an auditory learner who works through listening, simply talk yourself through the exercise, describing the idea to yourself in detail. Think clearly as to what small steps make up the task and consider each for a few seconds. Finally, bring the very first, smallest, highest priority step into the center of your focus until it is all you see in your thoughts. Hold that thought in mind for a minimum of one minute until all feelings of resistance give way and make room for a more comfortable, pleasurable feeling of ease at completing the one simple first step. Begin the first action while giving it absolute full attention, dismissing all external and internal distractions. Keep in mind that you can take any thought that makes a task seem unpleasant in your mind and make adjustments to the thought itself until the task becomes pleasurably attractive. You can break down an overwhelming thought, brighten a dark thought, inspire a boring thought, infuse humor into a dull thought, and raise courage out of a fearful thought. Whenever you interrupt and transform a negative pattern, keep your mind targeted onto the new productive thought until your entire mental state adjusts itself. Then begin your first small simple action right away. Be sure to watch our next training video in this series where we'll discuss the fifth powerful method for helping you defeat procrastination. This has been a Dynamic Mental Fitness Trainings presentation of Neurosculpting Video Training. If you need further assistance, you can contact a Dynamic Mental Fitness Trainer via the email address of trainer at neurosculpting.com. That's N-E-U-R-O-sculpting.com. Or by internet phone using Skype. The Skype address being dynamic.mental.fitness.